Uh, I guess. Uh, I think just playing basketball is a big step. Uh, everything else in between is just come. Um, goal is just to go out there and just be assertive, be aggressive, and do whatever uh, I can uh, for the team. Um, we're winning games, so it's, it's less individual, more just team right now. Uh, we just asked Drew about this, but do you think uh, Coach kind of giving you the ball more often on offense kind of makes you feel a little bit more involved, kind of gets you uh, your activity up on both ends? Yeah, I think it just works for the team, you know, uh, to put Ian in a situation to score um, and be out there and be, and be moving. Um, it just gives us a different look. You know, Ian can still bring the ball down. I can still run the wing. Um, but we just have the ability for everybody to play making. It's just adding to our playmaking situation and our, and our, our lineups. Um, even the situation where, you know, finishing the game, you know, we just have to be able to play with every uh, lineup that goes out there and know that we can finish the game. <laughs> uh, how much do you feel like I know a lot of the talk we have with Julius and Nico was the, the success you guys can have when AD was off of the floor. I mean, the numbers haven't really dictated that, but what do you think if you guys kind of have to do to kind of get those pieces together so you can have that success and kind of prevent AD from having those 38, 40 minute nights? Yeah, we just got to keep, uh, keep keep getting those guys out there. You know, um, uh, try to figure out the rotations. You know, we still, you know, we're just getting West implemented in. You know, Jaleel is getting healthy. Um, and so we're still trying to figure it out. It's still early in the season, um, especially right now. The practices, you know, we got two games coming back, uh, coming up back to back. So it's hard to kind of get it going in practice. You know, don't want to overwork guys, and then we're playing. So we're just going to keep figuring it out uh, through the game situations, and you know, we have to be ready for games like uh, you know the last one where it comes down to the wire and we have to make key stops, but everybody has to be ready. Solomon, with the coach saying in the last game that uh, you guys only went about 75% speed, is that something that's conscious effort now on your part since you are going to be part of the ball handling uh, crew and bringing the ball up? And is that something you guys can, you know, quickly turn around and switch the ball quickly in the next few games? Um, I can start on defense, honestly. If we if we get stops and, and it allows us to run, you know, it allows us to get our pace up. If we're not getting stops and guys are coming down and they're making good plays and they're, and they're knocking it down, it takes away from our running ability. You don't want to just always want to be running after made shots. So, um you know, we figure it out on both ends of the floor, but, you know, it's a part of the pace we play. I think you kind of run faster without the ball when you got to get to the corner. So uh, I'm, I'm used to it, and, and we'll, we'll figure it out together, and um, I, I look forward to running.